Hi, on this video, I'll try to create a Spring Boot project with basic HTTP authentication. Okay, let's get started. So from the Spring Initializer, so I will have these three dependencies, web, security, and then actuator. Okay, and the rest of the configurations are like this. I already have uh, downloaded the project and extracted it. I will open this in my IDE. I'm using NetBeans on this case. So this is the project. So the next step will be creating a service. This is a service which will uh, authenticate the user with uh, some sort of backend uh, services but for now I am just hard coding the user uh, and then validating the user when someone logged in okay. so as you can see the usernames are maintained in a map It's supposed to be uh, checked with some sort of backend processes like database or something, but in this case, I'm just maintaining it in a map. Okay, then the next will be uh, creating a custom uh, authentication provider. You can check the references for further details. That's the right uh, dependencies. The next is the configuration web security configure uh, adapter implementation actually. Okay. So over here basically I'm authenticating every request with basic authentication. So the last thing is the controller which is the access point to the uh, this particular application. So this is a REST endpoint. The application is basically ready so let's build this run this actually in uh, netbeans okay it started successfully let's go to the endpoint it will ask for authentication i'll give a false authentication so if you check the lock it says that not authorized because over here i'm printing it out not authorized so i'll give an authenticated user uh, a1 right so a1 okay let's try this a1 Okay, now we managed to authenticate accordingly. You can see, right? A1 is authorized. Okay, uh, that's all for this video. Thank you for watching.